What's up, YouTube? We're back. It's your boy, Mad Stacker. And we're here because we got a big order to open. Hey guys, welcome back. Sorry for the close up. I didn't want to stop once I started though. We are here because we've got a pretty good size order from H. Uh, hold on. Yeah, Hero Bullion. I was going to say HB Bullion, but it's Hero Bullion. Just trying to make sure I was on the right page. So just want to say in the shout out, happy Saturday to everybody. I'm recording this actually before the premiere train lineup has been out. Uh, so I don't know if we have anybody out sick this week. But considering it's our normal lineup, uh, make sure you go back in the description and check out the links if you missed them. If you weren't there live or if you got here live and late and you want to know where the train started, you can go back to the Wolf 56. All the links are below. And then you got Will's Treasures, Mrs. Coin Crew, Wild West um pistol packing pilot big red bullion stacks and stuff all amazing amazing channels we've had a pretty consistent lineup for a while sorry about that camera started making a little funny noise looks like i picked up some coppers too i don't really remember grabbing coppers but um Wow, they put a funny looking bag on this thing. That's weird. All right, let's see if we can get these open and figure out what's inside. Maybe we can't. Oh, so apparently they didn't all fit. That's just weird. Huh. Curious as to what that uh, QR code does. If you want to scan it. I don't know. This is a uh, United Snakes, it says. So let's find out what it is. Oh, this was like the, uh, almost like a Zombux, but not quite. Come on, camera. Stop with the noise. Thank you. United Snakes of America. I didn't even know what was on the back. I think I got it because of this side. 1937. So that's pretty high relief. So I'm guessing those raised edges are probably what stopped it from fitting in the tube because I can't imagine it would be more than 20. Three, six, nine. 13, 17, 20. Yeah, it's 20. They just don't fit. All right, let's see what the other one was. And then we'll get to some silver. How about that? I'm just going to go ahead and peel this off instead of cutting it because I don't like the sticker part on there anymore. Anyway. And this one, they had to stick a little styrofoam in because it didn't take up enough room. All right, I see a theme here. This says, protect the Second Amendment. Oh, that's cool. A well-regulated militia being necessary to the security of a free state. The right of the people to keep and bear arms shall not be infringed. Doesn't say it shall not be taken away. 
doesn't say it shall not be stopped. It says it shall not be infringed. That means no uh, gray area nonsense. No, you know, you can do it here, but you can't do it there. Infringed means do not mess with it. Do not infringe upon it. There is no room for discussion there. There's no if, ands, or buts. It does not say if some people don't know how to act. It does not say if it's 2020. It does not say any of that. It says shall not be infringed. And what are the... Man, you know, if I could just sit and have a conversation with our forefathers, their, their sheer understanding of what could come just blows my mind. Right? All right, let's see what we got here. Oh, I got some more of the uh, International Year of the Babies. These are uh, from Costa Rica. These are just over an ounce of silver. These are awesome. These are seeing colonists. That is a commemorative. Looks like I got a uh, Armenian Noah's Ark there. And this is, what year is this? Does it not say what year it is? Am I losing my... Oh, it's super small. I always forget about that. All right, that's a 2021. I'm going to hit pause and see if I have one of these real quick. All right, so the answer to that is yes. I do already have a 2021 Noah's Ark. So these are auction pickups at some point. Why do I have a Santa round? Surely I didn't order Santa. Maybe I did. Maybe this order is from so long ago that I was getting ready for Christmas. Well, going to be tough to do anything with them now. But we'll see. You never know. Those won't be tough to do anything with. These won't be tough to do anything with. These International Year of the Babies are... I can't remember the mintage off the top of my head. I think I put it the first time I showed them. Uh, but they are low. The mintage on that is low. Alright, so I've got some Santas. I've got some Noah's Ark and some International Year of the Babies there. Let's see what else we got. I think they may have combined a couple of my orders together. Because maybe one of them was kind of held back or something. All right, looks like I got some more tigers here. Oh, wow, those are wrapped in plastic. That's pretty cool. You guys all know what this is, the 2022 Year of the Tiger. Would have loved to have got the Dragon Privy, but I never saw those anywhere. But I have seen people with them. All right, before we get into this, I got a couple things I want to talk about. You guys, I don't know if I need to extend this. I'm going to do that. I'm going to extend this. Go back to January 1st and watch my video from January 1st. It's a 15-minute video roundabout from the premiere train, and I give you a way to shout out Steve looking for silver and win this amazing MS-70 2011 San Francisco ASE and nobody's doing it and I don't know why like this is an amazing prize so I'm going to extend that out uh, until the 22nd to give you guys one extra week to get in on this and speaking of the 22nd go check out on Mattis Stacker I have a shout out for Big Red Bullion and his big party on the 22nd. And I tell you a way, uh, not just to win silver at Big Red Bullion's, but I tell you a way to win extra silver in conjunction with his 2K party. So don't miss out on the extra silver. Definitely, definitely, definitely go check that out. I'm trying to hook you guys up. Well, there we go. 
Now, I'll be honest with you. I do not remember ordering these. That is a two ounce chunker right there. Let me get a glove here. Is minted during the C19 pandemic. That is pretty cool. That's well made. I'm going to have to see if I have a capsule these can fit in. I don't know if I do. Looks like I somehow ended up with more of the International Year of the Babies. I don't know if that was on purpose or an accident. But it is what it is. Man, I got a bunch more of them. Goodness gracious. And it looks like I picked up five of these two ounce rounds here. Now, I am going to, I think I'm going to keep one of these. I'm going to put one of these in my stack. And you guys know, once it goes in my stack, it never goes back. So, don't forget, Steve looking for silver. Don't forget, Big Red Bull, Jan. We had a crazy little order today. I wonder what the total on all that was. Oh, they don't tell me. Well, there you have it. They do not tell me. No worries. I'll look it up. Clearly, probably over a thousand bucks here. Um, and I'm excited to add two ounces to my stack. And I don't know if I'll do these as giveaways. I don't know if I'll do them as auction add-ons. I don't know. We'll figure that part out as we go. But these are probably my favorite ones. So, all right, guys. I appreciate y'all coming to hang out. Go check out all the people in the links below. Go check out all their videos. And come see us this evening on trade day with Everyday Opportunity. And if you're going to be in Texas next weekend... Um, the 21st and the 22nd is the Houston money show, which is up in Conroe on the North side of town. So, uh, if you're thinking you might go check that out, let me know. We'll hook up, have lunch or eat there. They've got a little concession stand as well and look at some silver and make some deals and just, uh, have a good time. So appreciate you guys being here. Do not worry about fitting in because we are all mad here.